up. And it's interesting because it's important to know if you're going to administer this. It's kind of interesting if you've never had to deal with this. So sometimes every once in a while you've got a user, they're getting fired, they're getting whatever, and you need to disable their account right away. But you need to make sure that they're locked out of all their systems. And that can be really kind of interesting to do. So I want to go to users. And again, I only have me as a user, so we're going to be going ahead and playing on this one. But we go to our users here and then we've got a lot of other options here and what's really kind of interesting about this is that um, you know you can go ahead and suspend the user right if you need to but we can actually go into that user user and kind of check and see you know what they're actually using and how they're actually done um, you can reset their password which is really kind of important to do again suspend the user I can't do this here because that's me. Um, and then we need to go down to security. And then we need to go to um, the security keys, advanced two-step recovery, require password change um, on signing cookies. This is where you want to be able to go. If you click reset signing cookies, that basically resets their whole account. So they will have to log in. So you and again, because this is the master account, right? You can't really do a whole bunch of stuff. So the first thing you do is you suspend the user and then you reset all their sign-in cookies. And that essentially forces them off the Google platform. They'll have to try to log in, but now their user account will be locked out. So for any reason you need to do that, Signing cookies is the way to do it. And again, to get there is going to users, going to the specific user, going to security, and it's mostly towards the bottom. Now, the other thing to do too is check connected applications. Make sure that there are no connected applications for this. Um, and then go ahead and delete all those because what can end up happening <laughs> is, or again, if they have access to your Google account, if you have stuff, you need to wipe, and re wipe their remote equipment. But they could go through and pull up some information on this um, through that third-party app. So you need to go ahead and delete all this stuff <laughs> just to make sure that um, they can't go and get their data off their drive or delete the data off their drive um, from this by using a third-party app. So again, if we're going to delete what a user's got, right, we need to go back and we need to go to users, click on user, go to security, click on sign in cookies, make sure that all those cookies are been reset reset locks them off make sure that they are suspended as a user and then go into all of their connected applications and just go ahead and delete those you have to remove them otherwise they can get data through the third-party app so it's kind of cool so if you ever have to sign a user out um, of their account this is the way to do it especially if you're just going to go ahead and and go ahead and let them go remember to suspend the user and don't worry about deleting them just suspend them especially if you need to do it right now okay that's it for this video kind of an interesting add to this um, i haven't seen anything on this on the test but this is kind of a really cool thing to know anyways